In this video, I will compare Shopify versus Zoho Commerce and tell you which of these tools may be best for you and your business. So go over what their features are and what exactly they do, who they are for and ultimately which one I would pick, depending on the stage of your business and what type of business you have. So first of all, both of them obviously allow you to create websites to sell your products and also keep track of your inventory and do a lot more. Now, Zoho has a lot of different apps that you may already be using for your CRM, for example. So if you are already using other Zoho products, then using Zoho for your website as well can be a very good decision. In terms of features, they help you with infrastructure, product filters, with product management, a site builder, as well as a visual editor, multi-currency view, customer management, order management, blogs, and more. Shopify is also an e-commerce website builder, but on top of just being able to sell on your own website, you can also use Shopify to connect to other platforms such as Amazon, Target, eBay, and more. With Shopify, you can also get a POS system, which is ideal for if you also sell in person. So their POS system basically allows you to take payments and they have different types of POS products for multi-store, single stores, and events. Now Shopify also has an app store with thousands of different apps for pretty much anything you can think of, such as upsells, email marketing, SMS marketing, and a lot more. In terms of pricing, you can see Shopify starts at 28 euros per month, which is also their most popular plan. And this is for solo entrepreneurs. Then for small teams, they have the 78 euro per month Shopify plan. They have advanced at 384 euros and plus for more complex businesses. Now you can see right here what is included in each of these plans. So for example, with basic, you already have 10 inventory locations. You can also do global selling in three markets. And if you want to do more than three markets, then in advance, you can add more for $59 per month each, or in the plus plan, you will get 50 markets. Now you can see they do also have the world's best checkout. So Shopify checkout converts 15% better on average than other commerce platforms. Zoho's pricing, on the other hand, is also surprisingly cheap. If you go with monthly, you can see the starter plan is 27 euros per month. However, the most popular plan is professional at 75 euros per month, where you already have five users and six contributors with 10,000 product listings, but only one pickup location. You will get live shipping rates, advanced coupons, unlimited customer accounts, and in the free plan, you also get abandoned card emails, offline and online payments, online store builder, up to 2000 customer accounts, and more than 20 free store themes. Then finally, they also have advanced for the B2B e-commerce businesses at 175 euros a month. Now, all of them have 0% transaction fees, which is very good. In terms of reviews, you can see on G2, Zoho Commerce has 81 reviews and scores 4.3 stars out of 5, and Shopify has 4,633 reviews and scores 4.4 stars out of 5. So Shopify does have a lot more reviews and a slightly higher score. So who should pick Shopify and who should pick Zoho Commerce? In my opinion, Shopify is best if you're looking for the most user-friendly e-commerce platform, also, if you need seamless integrations with your marketing tools, so Facebook, Instagram, Google, etc., and you prefer a vast app ecosystem, which I talked about earlier with their app store, as well as if you also want a POS system, and if you want to sell globally with international shipping built in, then I would also go with Shopify. On the other hand, I would pick Zoho Commerce. If you already use other Zoho apps, such as the CRM, their bookkeeping apps or perhaps inventory and you want to really easily integrate that. I would also go with Zoho Commerce if you run a B2B or hybrid store, meaning that you sell both B2B and B2C for their wholesale pricing and PO management. So if you sell to other businesses in bulk, I would also go with Zoho. Finally, if you prefer lower cost with no transaction fees, then I would also go with Zoho Commerce. So if you have a small to medium sized business selling B2C and you're looking for the easiest solution, or even if you have a large business, then I would go with Shopify. It's also used by large brands such as Gymshark. But if you already use other Zoho apps, you want the cheapest option, 
or you sell B2B, then I would go with Zoho Commerce. Now, if you want to use Shopify and you want to claim this deal where you can get three months of Shopify for only one euro, dollar or pound per month, they can sign up through the link down in the description and you will also get a three day free trial before that. So that concludes this comparison of Shopify versus Zoho Commerce. If this comparison helped you make a decision, please consider leaving a like and subscribing to my channel. With that being said, I will see you in the next video.